We've been in the Chicago area for a couple days now visiting family and we finally got a day that it wasn't raining. So we are in downtown Chicago exploring the sights. Doing it on the cheap today, not doing any of the big attractions, mostly doing walking and shopping. We're gonna do the Magnificent Mile, walk along the river, Millennium Park, Navy Pier, American Girl Doll Store. Yeah, that's all our girls care about. That's the only thing that's really important, right? Jelly beans, birdie box, every flavor beans, and there's black pepper and booger flavor. And you don't really find these very many places. What are you getting, Lana? The chocolate frog. From that looks really cool. And I'm getting Tabasco flavored hot tamales. Probably disgusting, but I'm gonna love them anyways. Another detour before the American Girl store is of course the Disney store. We haven't been in one in a long time, so we had to stop. What's your favorite one? Um, I like this one. And my favorite one is this one. Mommy and Daddy made us stop at a million stores before we got to the American Girl Store. And I'm so excited. I want the sushi set for my dolls. Sushi and then if I could fit, I'd get the sushi jammies. Just kidding, I just want to eat sushi. Finally found an Airstream that we can afford. This one's only $350. But it's only half and only a doll can fit inside. There's milk in here. You want some? Here you go. Yeah, do it. Yeah, we can see you. The funny thing is, Rachel's just as excited as the, for the American Girl doll store as the girls are. Yeah, I had one as a kid and I love them just as much as they do. But here's the thing, today's stop at the store was his idea. Well, so we came to Chicago like 10, 11 years ago before we had any kids and Rachel wanted to stop at the American Girl doll right, store. that was before Minneapolis had one in Mall of America. Then I got to go all the time whenever I wanted, so it's fine. I thought I would bring her that back. That was really nice. But in Toronto, we did not stop. He would not let us stop in Toronto. We had so much other things to do. I was shocked that he let us stop today. There's nothing for me to do in this store. Like, what's their next door? We'll go over there next. That one. And there's the other one. <laughs> I didn't put this thing on. 
Now this is more my kind of store. This, like I said, is $800. And it comes with like 10 people and look how big the set is. I'm gonna faint. One of the places we've missed eating since we moved away from Minneapolis is Big Bowl, and we found one here in Chicago. Um, we are inside the water tower, I think that's where we are, water tower plaza, something like that. And this is a food court where you come in and they reserve a table for you and then you pop around and order whatever you want on a little card and then pay on your way out. We all chose Big Bowl because we love it and we miss it so much. Done with lunch, done with shopping for the day. Now we are calling an Uber to head over to the Navy Pier. And then onwards from there, I don't know, Millennium Park? Probably Millennium Park. It turned out the sun came out, it's looking great. It's a good day. decided to eat their candy that we bought earlier today and what flavor of jelly beans are you eating? I ate pepper! Pepper? Next one, what's the next one? Mm. Can I have one? Can I try one? Try soap. Soap. Soap flavored. Yeah, tastes like dish detergent. That's pretty disgusting. I'm gonna try vomit now. Put it in your mouth. Let's test it. Ew. You want to vomit? I'm just bit into the wire. Uber finally made it to Millennium Park and now we are looking for the play garden so that the girls can have some fun and so that we can just relax and sit a little bit and they'll get out all their energy. You ready for that? Yeah! This is like, the, this has to be the most craziest playground in the world that I've ever been to. Look around you! Go down this 
one together? No. Can we do it together? Oh, yeah, let's do it together. One. Two. Two. Three. Go. I won. I was faster. I'm always faster. Ready for the slide? Yep. Bye. I'm gonna scream at that. One, two, three. Time to go. One more thing to see. More the bean. Gotta see the bean. It's crowded, but the girls have never seen it before and they're pretty much amazed. We're almost back to the car. It's time to go, but we found a Nutella cafe. I think we need to stop. Do we need to stop? Well, you'll get a drink there, but I'm just going to eat the whole store. We're in a chocolate store, and we don't know what we're eating. I think we're going to get some gelato. I think uh, Nutella. One ice cream for us to share. Wanted a crepe, but nobody else wanted a crepe, and I can't eat the whole thing, so I'll share. It's too hot for a crepe anyway. So that's it for our day in Chicago. It was quick. Yes. It was cheap. Six hours. Yeah. Cheap. Uh, yeah, pretty cheap. As I promised, we were going to do it on the cheap. So we spent $17 for parking. Uh, we use a new app that we haven't used before. It's called Spot Hero. You get to reserve your parking spot in advance. Uh, they tell you how much it's going to be and actually gives you a discount. So we didn't have to drive around to find the cheapest parking. The app showed us and what the cheapest parking was. And we, w we knew the clearance of the parking garage ahead of time. So yeah, for the we truck. had enough room for the truck. Yeah, and then we spent $35 on lunch, uh, about $20 on snacks for candy and ice cream, things like that. And then we took two Ubers because Chicago's big and we didn't want to walk around everywhere. And we spent about $25 on Uber. Uh, so all in all, right around $100-ish, which isn't bad for four people for a full day in Chicago. No, nope, not bad at all. And this is the first city that our children have not whined and complained most yeah, of the miraculously. time. Yeah, miraculously. They actually, Mariah actually talked about wanting to live here. So maybe this is our stop. Maybe this is where we end up. Who knows, we got a lot more places to visit. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and we hope to see you on the road.